everyone, and welcome back to Let's Play Dragon Age Inquisition. I'm your host, Lasan Fay, And so, last time we freed a bunch of people, got rid of some Red Templar generals, and now we are about to raid Suladin Keep. So, wish us luck. I'm almost definitely going to need it when I have not been keeping track of my health that well. This is the right way, I think. Ooh. Um, you know, after I get distracted by, uh, or... To the caves. Our fearless inquisitor leads on. Oop, loot. Actually, you know what? I got enough. And typically on um, keep takeovers, they give you. Um, Like a supply cache part way through. <laughs> so there's a room. Probably further forward. Worth checking around. Oh, loot. Don't tell me I've gotten lost. I have gotten lost. Oh, I was going the wrong way, wasn't I? where I would like to be. I've somehow made a wrong turn. <laughs> you know what? I'm going to check this ledge. Because, nope, that is just a ledge that is thrown in there. Oh, there it is. Hmm, sweet. Never got that before. Alright, but now I can drop that. And make my way back out. Figure out where the hell I'm going. I could have sworn that was the key. Mm. Okay, not that way. I made a wrong turn. This is back down to the quarry, right? Right? I killed people over here. Yep. Um, hmm. Let me go back to where I started the episode. 
We'll pretend that I haven't been lost. In fact, I intentionally went to go find that room that I've never found before and had no idea was even there. Um. Yeah, so. It's like nice and cold in this game, which is kind of similar to how I'm beginning to feel right now. To be honest, um, which is very cold. Um. Alright, just checking. Hey, did one of y'all happen to see where we were supposed to go? Where I missed that turn? backwards the whole way I opened that didn't I? yes okay so This is gonna bother me. This is gonna bother me a lot. Okay. Right, because up there's the key. Just let me walk up this rock. Okay, game. No, no. I need to go up. On that far side. Okay. No, that... Maybe I was going in the right direction. Ah. Why must I second-guess myself on these things? Ugh. And it's... Well, and I've also kind of killed all the Red Templars, so it's not like I can ask them for directions. Probably shouldn't be asking them for directions anyways. Um... Anyway... Okay, no, this is towards the key. Did I just make a bad turn? Because I fought more people. There a staircase? not a good thing. Really... Really don't remember this cave at all. Other than when I played it at the beginning of this episode. Or walked through it. clearly not going to work. Hmm. 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 Well. Okay. Alright. Let's see. Uh, 
Okay, because this clearly was not it. Is it over here? Maybe. Okay. Fine. We're gonna head towards that. <sighs> I either can't leave that or I already did, but I can't remember which. But there's a lot of red lyrium. So I'm going with I probably can't leave it. feel like I need to be higher up. Oh, this is a long, windy way. Very easy to get lost in. Game. Red Lyrium, we should be cautious here. Indeed, we should. We will. way down from here is clearly off of this edge hey what do you know not too bad and down one more down this way. That's how I found that place originally. Uh. Yep, it has been uh, a couple years, several games since I've played this. Okay. That's where I was earlier. Okay, so this is not getting me where I want to go. That is now understood. Thank you kindly. So... Okay. Back down here. Oh, so much fun getting very, very lost in this place. Ooh, dumpstone. I do actually kind of like this subtle ringing that is um, the red lyrium. Okay. 
Maybe not. I'm apparently on the wrong level. Are you well, Cole? Well wishing, waiting for once. Clean and clear, uncluttered. I am glad to hear it. Can I help you? You healed my hurt, but yours is old inside, vast across the veil. I am fine, thank you. There are others who need your help more urgently. Yes. Okay. Um, I took a quick tour around the quarry in Sarnia, famed for its azure granite. The owner of the mine, Alban Pauline, proudly informed me that 500 blocks of stone from that very quarry were used to tile the bathing chambers of Lady Matilon's summer estate. Okay. Was it that way? No, because that was just a wall. Wait. Wait a minute. Aha! This, this looks new? Yes? Yes? No! No! Damn it. Uh, I'm just back to where I was. You were supposed to be new and lead me to something useful and different. I went back over in there. There wasn't anything up here. Well, that's too far. <laughs> okay. Um, you know what? Maybe I come back up here. Because apparently, I'm in the wrong spot. <sighs> and they just talked. They're not going to talk again. I've been walking around and being lost this whole time. It's driving me nuts. So I think I just... Me too. Acknowledge. That. Where is it? Come on, I hear you. There you are. Alright, Cole, you're gonna lead the way for a bit. While I wait for the char player character to teleport back to us. Any second now. Maybe I should be playing Solus. At the very least, I know how to use a mage better. Oh, crap. Uh, but I'm playing a buffy mage now and not a...
Yeah, clearly. Uh, hi. Sorry, didn't mean to almost get you killed. Where the hell is the Inquisitor? Full. What? Oh dear. Inventory's very full. Uh, there's a quest. Probably a note. Yep. Uh, find what was glimmering the rubble. Hey, born face, you know our usual spot under Judy's crossing? Was there. I was there fishing two nights ago when the entire thing came down. A thunderous noise like you'd never heard. The maker must have been watching my side behind. I don't know how I got out of there alive. It was those damn Templars. I told you there was something shifty about them. Anyway, I was picking myself up when I saw something glittering in the rubble on the shore. I would have gone mad. I would have gone and looked, but those Templars were poking around what was left of the bridge, and I didn't want them to see me. I'm thinking there might have been some sort of treasure hidden in the bridge. I'll need you on lookout while I dig. Come by when you have a mind to. We'll head over. Hook knows. Okay. Ah, there you are. Now you've caught up. Now we're on the right path. But hey, at least I um, found some things that I hadn't found before. news, Harald. Your efforts to drive off the Red Templars have not gone unnoticed. You're kidding. Im Shale knows we're here. He sent Red Templars after me, and a pack of shades descends now upon Sarnia. Oh, great. The people are defenseless. I must return without delay. It's up to you to destroy Im Shale. Okay. Cassandra. What's part of the door? <laughs> Some sad splinters. All right. shocking me. good crafting materials, so I'm not going to complain. Rush fine, and... I don't know what else, but I will. We made it into Suladin Keep.
More crafting, because that's what's always in these bags. Phoenix skips. Alright, let me out. Papers. Uh, do we know anything about that Imshale fellow? Where did he come from? Why are we to defer to him? He's not from the Order, so as far as I know... So far as I know, there's something about him that makes me uneasy. Hate it. Hmm. Maybe because he's a demon? Thanks for not attacking me when I, like, just appeared in your sight. Um... Writing has become difficult. There is a sharp pain in my hands when I move them, like shards of glass in my knuckles. When I look in the mirror, I don't recognize myself. I remember when Lieutenant Ear Erasmus got this way. He looked like a living corpse. His complexion a facsimile of the blush of life. Instead of blood, it was pulsing red lyrium. It killed him and kept him alive at the same time. I don't want this anymore. It gave me power, but it goes against everything I was taught. Sometimes I am swept along with the fervor. But in quiet, I remember what I was and what I believed. Some say Imshel can cure us. He can pull the red lyrium from our bodies if we ask him. But there's a price. No price would be too high. I just want to be myself again. Yeah, about that. Done, everybody. Thankfully, they are giving us crafting stuff, including trade touch crafting stuff, which is super nice. More documents, test notes. We must carefully control exposure to red lyrium. The last one entered a savage frenzy from. The lyrium, we had to put it down. Once the red lyrium takes hold, their strength increases as we expected, but it makes them even more difficult to leash. Until we obtain the creatures in large enough numbers to test different techniques, we will never achieve a reliable method uh, of corruption and control. I may have to recommend setting aside the entire experiment. Surely the behemoth serves our purposes. Uh. Huh. We found the heart of the Red Lyrium operation. Indeed. The giant brought from the Emerald Graves last week died this morning. It had received a small injury to the abdomen that eventually killed it. We only have one surviving giant. Fortunately, the first changes have been promising. I am hopeful. It must be difficult to capture the creatures without violence, but there is too much at risk in beating them into submission. Breeding them might be feasible. Unfortunately, no one has spotted a female of the species. Okay, so that's a giant. Yep, that's a giant. <laughs> this weather, I'm glad for my armor. And this one. So that must have been the. So this is the one that died first, and that one died from red lyrium. Or this one's still alive, and that's just a gurn. Lovely. Okay. Well, I think we all know what's ahead now. But I'm going to go ahead and leave this episode here. I want to thank you all so much for tuning in. And in the meantime, in between time, take care, have fun, and happy trails.